Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Clay and at today's video, we're going to be checking out my best Holger 556 class setup in Modern Warfare 3. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and also like the video. Let's try to get this video to 65 likes. I highly appreciate it. It helps out the channel a bunch. In this gameplay, I actually ended up dropping an MGB. I was very doubtful going into the gameplay because I was using the gun multiple times. I changed the, cl uh, the class setup around multiple times and i just couldn't get anything going but in this gameplay i actually ended up dropping an mgb for you guys i hope you guys enjoy that now let's jump straight into the class setup over on the optic i'm going to be using the slate reflector this is personal preference you can go with whatever you want you could even take this off and probably throw on another attachment that you want over on the stock i'm going to be going with the holger 26 factory stock this gives us recoil control tax stance spread hip fire spread and sprint to fire speed the cons are aiming auto sway and sprint speed and movement speed. Over on the rear grip, we're going to be going with the Morn 20 grip for flinch resistance, recoil control, and gun kick control. The cons are aim walking speed. Now, this is another personal preference attachment. I like having more rounds in my magazine. You do lose out on a little bit of movement speed, aimed on sight speed, reload quickness, and sprint to fire speed. Now, this is a very 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 useful muzzle we are going to be going with the t5 one r or t51 r billeted break for vertical recoil control firing aim stability and gun kick control the cons are horizontal recoil control and bullet velocity and range now i would go with this one or you could go with the t4 lr uh compensator this gives you horizontal recoil and gun kick control like I said, I ended up dropping an MGB with this class setup. I hope you guys enjoy that. Hit that like button if you do, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace. A small percentage of people that watch my videos are subscribed, so if you like this video, consider subscribing, and also follow me on Twitch where I stream and play with followers. Also, if you'd like to, you can follow me on Twitter where you can stay up to date with me, and I also have a Discord, so if you'd like to, we can connect more on there. Now let's get back to the video. All right, we're going to be checking out the Holger 556. I don't normally like playing on this map, but because it kind of gives me like shipment vibes and it's just not really that fun to me. I get shot like by my teammates and I just don't know if there's actually somebody there and there ends up being somebody there doesn't make any sense who's that spawn poor guy okay this guy spawns up already looking at me My controller's so messed up. Check behind me, you never know where they're gonna spawn. Wow, okay. Sure. How is that guy not dead? Jeez, I, I don't even know what's going on on this map. It's so hectic. I'm 
No. I didn't reload. Almost lost that because the Renetti is just not that good. Thought I heard somebody behind me right there. Oh. Sure, I'm reloaded. I'm on a 21 right now. I feel like I'm gonna end up dying to some BS, but. What did I say? Oh my god, that spawn is terrible. I've only nuked this map once. I would really like to do it again, but let's see. There we go. Oh my God. That dude just walked right in front of me. Oh, well, we nuked it again. My controller. This was like an accidental nuke. Like I, I wasn't even supposed to get one. <clears throat> Well, we finally died, so. Why are you jumping behind me? Hello? another nuke streak here try to get something oh my god that was a good play out of him
Oh, we got 79 kills, though. I'm gonna go ahead and call this in. <clears throat> Well, we got 81 kills. GG's.